Yo, what is up guys? It's the Goblin and in today's video I'm going to be talking about the best rushing class in Call of Duty Black Ops 3. This class is basically going all out rushing and there is to no regard with this class. It is with the Diamond Vesper as you'll see me using in this gameplay as I make some nice little wall run plays right here. So this class is absolutely dominant at rushing. Do not use this class if you're not a player that likes to get right up in the enemy's faces, like literally right up beside them and hip fire or do do some quick kills. You know, this, this class is for pure rushers so if you're not a pure rusher you probably won't play that well with this class but uh, before we get into this class I'd like to say make sure to subscribe to my channel if you guys are new if this is, this is the first video you guys are seeing from me and also be sure to like this video let's get the likes up on this thing so I'll show the class up on screen right now and let's talk about it so here we have it we have the Vesper now the attachments that I have with the Vesper are going to be the extended mags and the fast mags first of all the Vesper is a fully auto SMG it's got the fastest fire rate in the class which basically means it's the best one to rush with but it does have a lot of recoil as you guys will know, the faster the fire rate, the more recoil the gun's going to have, and this thing does not do well at medium to long range, especially when we're just going to run the extended mags and the fast mags. But the reason for this is, this is one of the first CODs, I think, ever, where you can run extended mags and fast mags. And look at me in their spawn systems here. I'm just going off. But I uh, use the extended mags and the fast mags, and that just allows you to reload your gun, also have the big clip, and take out multiple enemies at once. And that's the reason why we're using that. However, we don't have long barrel, and we don't have grip, so you're not going to have very much success at all trying to kill people at any sort of range so make sure you don't try to do that at all and then let's get right into the perk setup on this thing so this thing i'm gonna run gonna be running two first perks i'm gonna be running flak jacket and six cents now these perks are very good for rushing obviously i need to have that flak jacket so if i run across some sort of c4 or a trip mine or whatever here's where i go having the spawns actually if I run across something like that, I'll be able to survive. And then I need the six cents to show me when I'm rushing their spawns where exactly they're going to be at. Second perk is just going to be scavenger for the simple fact that scavenger is pretty much going to be on all of my class setups because you don't want to run out of ammo. And with this gun, you probably you get like in this game you only get like three or four like full uh, magazines before you run out of ammo. And that's definitely why you're going to want to run scavenger on any of your fully auto classes or anything like that, other than like a shotgun or a sniper. You're always going to want to run scavenger. And the good thing about scavenger is it also replenishes the grenade so that's why I throw myself on with the secondary grenade now the secondary that I have on this class is just the pistol but you can swap that out for whatever um, it's just because right now I'm fourth prestige but I'm only level like 15 or something so I don't have the RK5 burst pistol so you can swap out to your favorite secondary right there and then the perk 3 we're going to have blast suppressor because you're gonna be having to outplay a lot of people you're gonna be having to do some jump shots you're gonna have to be having to do some slide kills and stuff like that a blast suppressor will silence those movements so the camera won't be able to hear you you know making your jumps up and stuff like that and they won't be able to see you coming and wait for you on a head glitch or around a corner or something like that because you do have that blast suppressor so that's the class setup now let me talk a bit about how this gun is going to play and how this play style will work best with this class setup. So like I said before, this is a full out rushing class. Now in this gameplay, I was actually going ham on the second round of some combine domination and I was actually running myself with the UAV and the Wraith and then the Hater, which is actually a good kill streak because you need the UAV uh, for a rushing class. Now you can either go non-lethal as UAV, counter UAV and then the Hater, or you can run yourself like a UAV and then the Wraith and then the Hater. There's, there's many different setups as long as you have the those UAVs. UAVs are pretty powerful in this game because um, a lot of people, especially now that the game just came out, it's only a week old, a lot of people don't have ghosts yet so that the UAVs are going to be very effective. And then obviously you do get those UAV assist 10 points per kill, which are going to be very helpful. Now, as far as a specialist that you're going to want to run with this class setup, there's um, there's a few that you could run. You could run the overdrive, and now that makes you speed up. That would make you run to the enemy spawn really quick and probably get two or three kills without them being able to catch you. That would be kind of fun to do. You can run the vision pulse, so then once you, you're in up, up in their spawn, especially on a small map like this, if I'm around this area, I know the vision pulse, if I pop it, it's going to spot at least one or two of them back in their spawn. So that's why you could run the vision pulse, or you could also run the combat focus which you could just pop that and then go and get a few kills get a capture kill or something like that which will help you build up to your streaks that's all up to personal preference but hopefully you guys did enjoy this video if you guys did make sure to subscribe to my channel if you guys are new make sure to drop a like on this thing i'd really appreciate all the likes that we could get now, if you guys don't like the video you can leave a dislike you can leave a like whatever in this gameplay i think i got like 79 kills so you can see this class works pretty well considering i didn't have the best first round ever hope you guys did enjoy this video and i'm out peace thanks for watching guys